Good morning, Warriors. I'm Haven. And I'm Shakira. Today is Thursday, March 28th. We will be having pork loin for lunch today. Congratulations to Lexington Chapel and Maddie Rasky. They both made the OIE guilt sale and sold their animals for astonishing amounts of money. Great job, Warriors. Also at OIE, Mr. Whelan was one of the three administrators that received the Chairsman Award. This award is given to school administrators that show unwavering dedication to the youth agriculture students of their community. Our FFA chapter stated that Mr. Whelan goes above and beyond in our community and we are extremely proud to have him running our ship. Congratulations on this well-deserved honor. Prom is approaching quickly. It will take place at the Falls on April 6th at 7 p.m. Don't forget to purchase tickets from Ms. Dandridge. State testing begins next month. Students, make sure you show up well-rested and ready to go on dates you are scheduled to test. We only have about six weeks of school left and the schedule is jammed packed. With all the activities going on, make sure you are staying on top of your work and finish the school year strong. Good luck to the students that are taking part in the EOSC judging event today and to those traveling to Jinx for the speech contest. June 8th, the FCA is hosting their annual River Run 5K. Sign-ups are live now. Grab a friend and get ready to walk or run to help raise funds for this amazing organization. Congratulations to our outstanding accelerated readers. Maylee and Christian have reached 150 AR points and Jax has reached 200 points. Great job, Warriors. Parents of the class of 2024, Senior biography information sheets were emailed to the seniors on Monday. Please get with your senior to help ensure they have filled them out correctly. The form is due back to Ms. Mills by May 6. Seniors also need to make sure that they have gotten their slideshow pictures to Ms. Ruckman. Those are due by April 18th. Pre-K enrollment for next school year will be April 2nd from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. Instructions are listed on this graphic. There will be no school tomorrow to observe Good Friday. Students will also be out of school on Monday, April 1st. Enjoy your four-day weekend. On this day in 1969, Dwight D. Eisenhower, the 34th President of the United States, died at age 78. Today is National Black Forest Cake Day. Celebrate today by enjoying a slice of this delicious treat. That's it for us. Now let's look at the weather. Good morning. I'm Big Mac, and here's a look at your weather. Today's high will be 69 degrees. We will get plenty of sunshine today with some decent temperatures. This weekend, we will see some nice warm-up with some clouds mixed in. The weather on Sunday is looking like a prime Easter egg hunting weather. Next up, we have sports. Talani here with a look at your sports. The junior high softball team played in Gore on Monday and is playing in Vian today. The high school softball team played in the Purim Festival on Tuesday. They played multiple games. They also play Vian today. We will get results for next week. Good luck, Lady Warriors. Okay. The high school baseball team played on Monday and Tuesday. They also start the River Falls Tournament today. <laughs> this is a great chance to come check out the new facility and cheer the team on. Good luck, Warriors. Chandler and Nashville will be headed to Weatherford next Saturday, April 6th, for the Middle School Mario Kart State Championship. Good luck, Warriors. We had three powerlifters placed at the state powerlifting competition. Congrats, Zane Nolan, for placing fourth. Maddox Shelby for placing second and Gunner Carey for placing first. Great job, Warriors. Before break, the track team competed in Poto. Abby, Bridget, Terry Lynn, and Shannon placed third in the 4x800 meter relay. Abby, Audrey, Bridget, and Terry Lynn placed third in the 4x400 meter relay. Great job, ladies. The junior high track team competed in Henrietta on Tuesday, and the high school track team is competing in Wilburton today. Good luck, Warriors. That's it for sports. Hello, I'm Tiffany. We have several Warriors of the Week this week. First up is Rayleigh, Gracie, Joseph, DJ, and Cash. They gave up part of their spring break to help serve dinner at the Gospel Rescue Mission. Next is Sophie and Gracie. They helped out at the closed closet to make it a better experience for everyone. Lastly, Riker and Gracie spent the first day of break working the food handout. Thank you to each group for going out of your way to help others. Great job, Warriors. That's all we have for today. Thanks for watching, and remember, to be true to one's own freedom is to honor and respect the freedom of others.